Hi guys and welcome to All About the Philippines. Ah, some exciting news. Uh, we've passed the 1,000 subscriber mark. We did that a few weeks back. We're now over 1,100 and I really wanted to just give a shout out to all you guys out there who have supported me for a, you know, quite some time as well as uh, the people who have uh, come into the channel recently. Uh, I, re I really do appreciate everybody. I re appreciate the support that you've given me. I appreciate the community that you've made uh, all about the Philippines into. Uh, it's all because of you guys that we've got the channel and we continue to do what we do. Be assured that I do screen a lot of the comments. So every, every comment that comes through is screened. There's of course people that I know very well on here that have been part of the channel for some time that, that have automatic, um, that will automatically be uh, approved for their comments. But anyone who comes into the channel, if you don't see your comments up there straight away, it's because they're waiting to be approved. And once I get to know you as well, then those comments will also be automatically approved. It's just a way of stopping um, people coming in and trying to create drama, having a go at other members of, of, of the community, um, having a go at me maybe even. You know, I'm all open and well to discussion. Not everybody has to agree on the same things. That's fine. But when people get personal and, and uh, start to attack each other, that's when it will not be tolerated. So if you don't see your comments there straight away, they're just waiting to be approved. That's all that is. Uh, just a way of keeping our community, um, you know, a happy place to come to. So the second thing is uh, we have a new ebook. So for the last few months, I've been working on an ebook. And it's called All About the Philippines information for the new traveler so it's jam-packed with a whole heap of information history about the philippines what, what sort of accommodation you get in cebu manila street food what what sort of other food can you get in uh the philippines right through to the top five islands so that what i believe the top five islands to go to are uh, top of tourist attractions. We talk about uh, different scams in the Philippines. And we also talk about the laws in the Philippines and knowing what the laws in the Philippines are around adultery. So any of those people going there for to meet Filipinas would be very wise to have a, a bit of a read on that and read up about the laws in regards to adultery in the Philippines. Uh, so that's that's the book. So I'll, I'll put a link below where you can get that book on, uh, you can get it on Amazon Kindle and you download it to your computer, iPad, whatever. And you can take that with you when you go to the Philippines as well. So really, as I say, it's, it's, it's a book for the new traveler, someone who is not very experienced in going to the Philippines, or maybe even those who just are interested in the Philippine history and culture, that sort of thing. So uh, probably worth checking out, guys. Some of you might notice now that we're on these chat videos such as this, we're using a green screen, which is behind me, and we're, you know, basically putting in nice backgrounds to look at that sort of thing. So it's just a bit better than watching me when I do my chat videos, and you've got, you know, a brick wall behind me or a wall or a lounge room. So in these sorts of videos, I'm trying to learn how to use the green screen. So it's all about getting the lighting right and i think in this video we've hopefully got it pretty right so we'll see how it comes out but it will it will give you know just not nice backgrounds you can put video backgrounds there as i did in one video before of the ocean and sunset that i took um, or you can just put you know just standard pictures and it just makes it look a bit nicer so we're having a bit of fun with that at the moment so let me know what you think about the green screen. I'm very interested to know your thoughts, if you, if you think it makes a difference to the videos or not. And we've got upcoming videos. So I'll just give you guys a bit of a heads up as to what's coming up in the next uh, week, week and a half. So the next video coming up is about online dating, in the, specifically in the Philippines. Uh, but these, these will apply to anywhere, uh, not just the Philippines. And we give some tips to make it work, how to make it work. I will be doing a video down the track as well about the dangers of online dating. So I myself did a you know, went through online dating, and it all worked out fine and well, which is which is great, and it does for you know many people. There's also a lot of people out there who have a lot of 
uh, problems with online dating and we might explore that a little bit more to give people a bit of a heads up about that. We've got a video coming up where we go for a bit of a walk around Manila at night. So just you know, a bit of just a bit of a look around, see what's there, what, what happens at night, the life going on around. I've got a review on the Milano residence where we stayed in uh, Century City. So anyone who is looking for accommodation, that's something would be interested in this. We're up on the 38th floor there and the views were absolutely spectacular up there. So uh, have a look at the review and I'll give you my opinion on the Milano residences. We've also got a video coming up titled Things I Don't Like About the Philippines. So um, look, I love the Philippines. I've made that clear from day one. But they're all, in any country, there's stuff you don't like about it, the things that might frustrate you or annoy you or whatever. So I'm gonna have a talk about a few of those things. You know, the Philippines is a great place, but it also has its problems. So we'll have a bit of a chat about that. So I hope I don't upset too many Filipino peoples. Just remember, I do love the Philippines, but there is always with any country. Same here in Australia. There's plenty of things I don't like about Australia too. And the last one I've got on my list at the moment is a time-lapse video we did from the Milano residences on the 38th floor as the uh, sun was going down, watching watching the all the lights, basically watching uh, Century City light up. So uh, that was pretty cool. It's only a short, um, short time-lapse, but I had a bit of a chat about a couple of other things as well. But I hope you'll enjoy that one as well. So uh, look out for those videos. So again, guys, thanks very much for all your support. I really do appreciate it. Uh, without you guys, I wouldn't be sitting here doing this stuff. It, it, I, I really enjoy what we do here, and I hope you guys do as well. And I hope you keep supporting for some time to come. Thanks very much, guys. You all have a great day, night, evening, wherever you are. And don't, don't forget, if you're... If you're new to the channel, to subscribe, comment below. I'd love to hear your comments, especially about the green screen we've got going on. Don't forget to hit that notification bell as well, so you get more videos. We've always got plenty coming up. As we say, we, we upload every two days. Okay, guys, thanks very much. You all take care. Have a great day. Bye-bye.